yeah, I've got a big ass, so I'm gonna need a bigger suit, mate. Hi, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, then my name is Shannon, and today I wanted to do a little bit of an intro to a vlog that I did. So my best friend recently got back from overseas and she turned 20 while she was overseas. So I wanted to surprise her with something that I knew she would enjoy. She loves adventure and all that kind of shit. I love it too. And so instead of getting her a gift, I wanted to get her an experience. So I was tossing up between two things, which was indoor skydiving and uh, taking her on a hot air balloon ride super romantic <laughs> and I decided to take her indoor skydiving because she'd been raving about that before she went away and I had it already got it in a little tin I told her that we were going hiking or I let her think we were going hiking much to her um, disgust <laughs> I picked her up but I had my mum and everything in the car and gave her the present so that she could open it so it was a bit of a surprise and she seemed really excited which was really good so I actually kind of figured that she would know what it was but she did it which was great <laughs> so I booked indoor skydiving through the company called Adrenaline I don't no, I think they're pretty well known. They're a pretty popular company. Just wanted to do a bit of an intro because I didn't actually talk much in the vlog. I didn't want to just be like, boom, flying, boom, end of scenario. And while I was actually editing the footage, I kind of saw a couple of differences between myself and my friend, her name's Malaya. And I wanted to kind of talk about that because it's something that I started seeing and I was like, oh, but then I was kind of like, no, I think everyone experiences this every now and again. But basically, we got to this company and they suited us up, as you'll see in the vlog, and they chucked us in a tube and I guess we got to experience the closest humans will get to pre-flying without actually having to jump out of an aeroplane, which was awesome. If you're really scared about doing that, then indoor skydiving, go, it's amazing and you don't have that fear. I guess the, the differences that I saw, or the thing I wanted to touch base on, is this video is actually a pretty good representation of two different body types doing a bit of a different activity or a bit of an out there activity. And I know from experience that sometimes being nervous or I guess self-conscious can stop us from doing certain things because we're like oh my god you need to put on a flying suit Jesus that's gonna show you friggin every lump and bump and you'll see in the video that Malaya is a gorgeous girl she's very petite she's quite short <laughs> I think I don't know but she's a very petite slim um, body type whereas myself I am a very athletic I guess I've got big hips. I'm not <laughs> the definition of petite or delicate, which is fine. I love my body and I wouldn't have it any other way. But it was really cool to see the juxtaposition between Malaya's experience and my experience. You know, you can see in the video, Mal, she popped on her suit and it fit her straight away. Cool, she was good to go. And I actually cut this out because I didn't have enough time, but I actually had to try on three different flying suits before I found one that fit me and even then it was super super baggy up the top and really tight on my legs on my bottom half. I think a few years ago that would have been really disheartening for me to have to keep going back to the guy and being like no I need a bigger one I need a bigger one but I kind of made the decision then and there that I was like no stuff this I'm gonna have the best time ever and yeah I've got a big ass so I'm gonna need a bigger suit mate <laughs> um, I am not a size small and so I guess that was the first thing that I noticed when watching the video and the second is the difference well we were actually in the tube I don't actually know what it's called I'm just gonna call it a tube you can see how Mal who's super light she's just I guess flitters <laughs> I don't know how to describe it but I'm a little bit more you can see when I'm trying to like fly it's a little bit more I don't know what the right word is but it's not as graceful <laughs> um, and there's this one clip of me trying to get out of the tube that I literally cracked my oh I cracked up at it was just the least <laughs> graceful thing I've ever seen 
it was interesting just to see the difference between the two of us because we really are polar opposites you know she's brunette I'm blonde she's this tiny petite gorgeous little thing and I've got hips and a butt and curves and that's okay and so I just wanted to put this little side note in here that if you have an adventurous soul or you just want to try something new and you want to do something like this but you're scared because you might feel like you're on the bigger side, you know, or your friends are quite small because I've been there. Not that either body type is bad or better than the other, but don't let it stop you from doing something like this because I had a moment where I could have said, oh my God, I could have felt really bad because I had to go back and I think I ended up getting like an extra large suit. But I was like, no, I've spent money on this. I'm here with my best friend for her 20th birthday. We are about to go indoor skydiving. Who gives a flying if my suit is an extra large? Because I know I'm healthy and that's all that matters. And I had the most amazing time. It is a memory that I will cherish forever and an experience that I can say that I've had. And that is the most important thing at the end of the day. So I, this is a bit rambly. I didn't mean for it to be. But when you're watching this video, have a look at the differences between us and, and just kind of if that resonates with you and makes you feel better. Even though I am not a gazelle in any way, shape or form, it's still so much fun. And do it. Freaking do it. There was a little girl there and she was like 10 and she freaking aced it and she gave no shits and I was like, oh, I want to be as cool as you. <laughs> I really don't even know if this made sense. But all in all, don't let your self-consciousness or lack of confidence or fear of looking weird or chunky or making fool of yourself stop you from doing something amazing. And I 100% recommend indoor skydiving. <laughs> anyway, I hope you enjoy the vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, you can follow me on Instagram. My handle is Shannon Natalia. I'll link it in this description. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye. <laughs>